Welcome to the third um, chemical equilibrium video. Here's a question requiring our attention. It says 0 0.2 moles of iodine and um, hydrogen were introduced into a 1 liter container at 30 degrees Celsius. When equilibrium was attained, the Kc was found to be 64. What is the equilibrium constant of each of Hi, I2 and H2? Now to solve a question like this, the first step would be to write the equation of reaction, which is H2 plus I2 to give to HI. So this is the um, equilibrium or reaction. This is the equation for the reaction. Now, at the start of the reaction, as of when the reaction started, according to this story, 0 0.2 moles of this and 0 0.2 moles of that were added to the reaction vessel. So there was none of this. And so I'm going to call the quantity of this present 0 moles. As the reaction proceeded, what happened? Some H combined with some I to form HI. What quantity of H and one quantity of I reacted we don't know we don't know the quantities that reacted but what we would know for sure is one whatever quantities of these guys would react would definitely be less than 0 0.2 all of them would not react else there will not be anything like reversibility so whatever amount of these two guys reacted will be less than 0 0.2 and then second we know from the stoichiometry here that the quantity of H used up will be the quantity of I2 used up and the quantity of HI produced will be twice the quantity of any of these because it's 1 ratio 1 ratio 2. So let's assume that the quantity of H that was used up was X moles, X. So it means that here the H that will be left by the time equilibrium is attained will be 0 0.2 minus X moles. For I, it will also be 0 0.2 minus X. Then for the HI, there was none before, so 2X will appear from the X and X, like 1 and 1 used here to produce 2. So 2X of that will be produced. Now, how do we write the KC expression of this reaction? The KC will be HI squared over H2 into... I2 concentrations. So I'm going to bring these the equilibrium concentrations up here. So I'll say Kc, which is 64, is equal to 2x all squared. So that's Hi concentration squared over 0 0.2 minus x into 0 0.2 minus x. So again, I can say 64 equals. 2x squared over 0 0.2 minus x squared. At this point, I can take the square root of both sides. So taking the square root of both sides means I'm going to write root 64 is equal to 2x over 0 0.2 minus x. Root 64 is 8. So this becomes 8 into 0 0.2 minus x equals 2x. 8 into 0 0.2 is 1.6 minus 8x equals 2x. So that 1.6 equals 2x plus 8x and that is 10x. So that x is finally 1.6 divide 10 and that gives me 0 0.16. So I've obtained my x but that's not my answer. That's not my answer because the equilibrium concentrations of HI, I2, and H2 is what I was asked to calculate. And in this equation, I'm seeing them as 2x, 0 minus 2, or oh sorry, 0 0.2 minus x, and 0 0.2 minus x. So I'm going to say now, this is my answer. At equilibrium, concentration of HI equals 2x, which is... 2 times 0 0.16 and that's 0 0.32 then the equilibrium concentration of um, I2 will be equal to 0 0.2 minus X 
which is 0 0.2 minus 0 0.16 and that's 0 0.04 moles per dm cube and finally for h2 its concentration will be 0 0.2 minus x which is 0 0.2 minus 0 0.16 and that is 0 0.04 molar so here's the solution to the question what you have down here is not part of the um, what you have part down here is not part of the solution instead it is just my answer being reported so see the solution from here to there so you do well to study this i'll make way you can pause the video so that you can have this to yourself do well to study it study more questions on chemical equilibrium and um, feel free to comment if there are any questions you could drop them in the comment section but in the absence of that remember to subscribe to this channel remember to share remember to like remember to tell your friends about this channel and then our exciting videos we have on other topics do well to explore them at your leisure thanks for watching i'll see us in the next video